And more and more Floridians are ending up in the hospital with coronavirus. The Florida Hospital Association now reporting more than 15,000 patients statewide, and that is up nearly 300 people in just a day. As concerns grow, it looks like some fully vaccinated people will be urged to roll up their sleeves once again. Today, the FDA is expected to recommend an extra dose for at least some Americans. Ezzy Castro is at Camping World Stadium. Health leaders are talking about people with compromised immune systems, but the big question this morning is when will everyone need a booster shot? These vaccines work to save lives. They work to prevent hospitalization. The FDA is expected to announce today it is recommending a COVID-19 booster shot for people who are immunocompromised. The U.S. Surgeon General explained the boosters would be for those who are under treatment for cancer and organ transplant recipients, things that suppress the immune response to the vaccine. He also says they are looking to see when other Americans may be eligible. The broader question of whether the population at large needs boosters or more accurately a third dose uh, in the vaccine series is something that we've been looking at very closely. Dr. Vivek Murthy also brought up vaccines for children under 12, adding that could be coming soon. If everything were to go well and everything were to fall into place, I think it's possible that we could see a vaccine before the end of the calendar year for kids under 12. And after the FDA weighs in, the CDC is set to meet to talk about all of this tomorrow. In Orlando, Ezzy Castro, getting results, News 6.